Good day to everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Matinix and more. Today, I'm going to discuss another problems in motion problems involving al rational algebraic equ equations. And our problem for today is Tim, an open water swimmer, is training for the Olympics. To do so, he swims in a stream that is 3 meters per hour. Tim finds that he can swim 4 miles against the current in the same amount of time that he can swim 10 miles with the current. How fast can Tim swim with no current? Now again, as we are all know, motion problems is a problem involving displacement or change of position from one place to another. And Tim is a water swimmer. He swims in a stream that is 3 meters per hour, meaning the current of a stream is 3 meter per hour and Tim finds that he can swim 4 miles against the current in the same amount of time that he can swim 10 miles with the same current. How fast can Tim swim with no current? It means with the current he can swim 10 miles. And against the current, he can swim only 4 miles with the same time or with the same amount of time. Therefore, our problem now is how fast can team swim with no current? Now, in solving this problem, we need to find the speed, the rate of the, the speed, the distance, and the time that team can swim against and, and with the current. Now, if you are excited to know the solution, let's go. But please don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. And hit the bell button for all so that you will be notified for all incoming videos. Solving problems involving rational algebraic expressions. And we are now in motion problems and example number three. Tim, an open swimmer, open water swimmer, is training for the Olympics. To do so, he swims in a stream that is three meters per hour. Tim finds that he can swim 4 miles against the current in the same amount of time that he can swim 10 miles with the current. How fast can Tim swim with no current? Now, in solving worded problems, as I'm always telling you, let's go for the given data first. And our given data now is stream speed is equal to 3 meters per hour and distance against current is equal to 4 meters or 4 miles and distance along current is 10 miles actually the speed is 3 miles per hour and now we are required to solve for speed of team in miles per hour. Our solution is let x 
be the speed of team. And time is equal to distance over speed. Now, 4 over x minus 3 is equal to 10 over x plus 3. 4 is distance that team swim with or against the current, which is x minus 3. And this, it is equal to 10 miles over with the current, and this is x plus 3. Therefore, since it is the same amount of time that he can swim against and with the current, therefore, they are equal. So, let's go to the next slide and rewrite equation 4 over x minus 3 is equal to 10 over x plus 3. Since this is equation of two rational algebraic expression, we just cross multiply. What do you mean by cross multiply? The numerator in the left hand side multiplied to the denominator on the right hand side and denominator of the left hand side multiplied with the numerator of the right hand side. So we have 4 multiplied by x plus 3 and x minus 3 multiplied by 10 and they are equal. So we have 4 multiplied by x plus 3 equal to 10 multiplied by x minus 3. Simplifying the equation, we have 4x plus 12 is equal to 10x minus 30. And let's add both sides of the equation by negative 10x and positive 30. So 4x plus 12 minus 10x plus 30 is equal to 10x minus 30 minus 10x plus 30. Cancel 10x, 10x, 30, 30. So we have 4x minus 12 minus 10x minus 30 is equal to 0. And <clears throat> we have negative 6x plus 42 is equal to 0 and divide both sides or subtract both sides by negative 42 and rearrange the equation we have x is equal to 7 and team speed is equal to 7 miles per hour. How did we get it? First, first thing is we need to subtract both sides of the equation by negative 42 and we have negative 6x is equal to negative 42. Divided by 6 both sides of the equation, we have negative 42 divided by negative 7 and this is x is equal to 7, which is team speed as 7 miles per hour. Now, this is team speed in without current. Now, let us check if our answer is correct. Go back to the main equation. We have 4 over 7 minus 3 is equal to 10 over 7 plus 3. And this is 1 is equal to 1. Therefore, our answer for this problem, which is 7 miles per hour for team speed, is correct. Now, before we end this video, I want to share again with you 
one verse from the Bible. Ephesians 6, chapter 6, verse 12. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the powers of this dark world, and against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. Thank you and God bless. Bye-bye.